Um, welcome back, YouTube viewers. It's me again. <laughs> well, I don't know if you can really see I've got quite green hands. I've just been out mowing the lawn. <laughs> Not in a dirty way. <laughs> <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, I would be quite concerned if I went to my lady's uh um, a private lawn, and my hand turned out green. Gonorrhea really isn't a joke. I should know. Yeah, but um, actually, to be honest, um, the reason why I've got, I've got green hands, the reason why I was mowing the lawn is uh, is because uh, it's the only way I can make money these days. Um. And I suppose this is time really to tell you all a little bit more about myself. Um, I used to work in an IT department of a small warehouse company, um, but it got shut down. Um, it was bought out by a much larger international company. Uh, which is a shame, I suppose, but it's just another example of the consequences of international corporate capitalist globalization through the proxies of unity and equality. Yeah, it is a terrible shame, really. Um, and I don't just say that because I lost my job to a bigger corporation. Um, it's actually... Uh, the real reason is uh, I lost my favourite pie shop recently. Um, it was run by a lovely girl called Anna. And we used to make delicious pies. And um, it was... It was bought out by this disgusting sandwich shop called uh, uh, Substation or Underpass or something urban like that. And they just sell disgusting, oh, horrible things, really. And all the stories Anna used to tell me of the different types of pastry and, and, and the and the, and the gravies, all the different consistency of gravies. There was medium thick gravy, medium thick thick gravy, uh, medium strong, uh, medium weak, uh, medium thin, um, double thin, triple thin, uh, thin, um, uh, and and really, it just, the list just goes on and on. Um, but yeah. Yeah, but let's not linger on the past, eh? I don't really want to tell you all these silly stories and get you all down in the dumps or anything. Um, yeah, more about me. Okay, so um, I quite enjoy uh, listening to some music. I prefer uh, Rivaldi over Beethoven, to be honest. Um, though so Handel and uh, and Schubert, they're quite nice too. Yeah. I listen to some modern stuff like 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 Pink Floyd and Queen, um, uh, um, and some some more recent stuff. I know I I, I listen to a bit of uh Beyonce and uh what's her name, uh Madonna. Is that right, Madonna? Yeah, Beyonce and Madonna. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Um, but yeah, you know, you know, I do like a good bit of music now and then. <sighs> Uh, and now, uh, uh, well, uh, if you watch Norman Stevens' vlogs, you'll know that um, uh, we're in a band together. We are good mates. We uh, met in the IT department of the uh, warehouse where I worked. And um, we'll be getting together soon to be doing some lovely music. So that's something for all uh, all you fans to look forward to. Um, 
Yeah, apart from that, I don't really have um, any other things. Um, um, I've got Facebooks. Yes, that's right. Um, I am up to date with technologies like Facebooks. Um, uh, I've got uh, just to say, I think I've got about six friends on Facebooks. Oh my. Oh my god, my friends have just shot up. Oh, I didn't expect that coming. I have got 10 friends on the Facebooks now. Amazing. Anyway, um, I don't even know if I've got that many friends in real life. But, but, um, but yeah, you might have noticed I'm in a different room today. Um, that is because, uh, my, uh, one of my relatives is here today. He's, um, He's quite nice, quite friendly, but he's playing on the zombies on uh, on the in a different room. He's shooting up those zombies. He bought his Xbox to me. I'm supposed to supposed to look after him. Um, uh, uh, yeah, yes. Um, I told you a little bit about my hobbies last time. Um, well, I. Uh, it's worth playing a harmonica rather well. Um, I also uh, quite like the sports, and I'll be teaching you a good bit about sports in my next video. Uh, that's uh, that's another thing you can now look forward to. Um, I'll be talking about uh, football, or as our American friends call it, um, uh, so so saucer, saucer. Is that right? Do they call it saucer? Anyway, yeah, that will be going on. That uh, should be quite, quite good. Um, now to my fan art. It appears that because I am so uh, ridiculously popular, I have received some lovely uh, fan art from um a girl in America. Uh, her name is uh, Kylie. Um, uh, I've I've looked at her videos. Um, she, she did actually give me a migraine, and I had to take uh, six uh, ibuprofen tablets and uh, lie down on my back for six hours. And she's doing all this thing, waving her hands around, and it really confused me. It made me feel quite sick, to be honest. Um, but apart from that, she's lovely, you know. Yeah. And um, I've got to say, if I wasn't 35, um, I would happily let her pickle my gherkin, as it were. <laughs> 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 but no, she's 14, and that's actually quite inappropriate. I'm very sorry for that, but I'm still going to put it in the video, because I thought it was quite funny. And if you've got a problem with that, then I'm very sorry. Get the police around and kill me, whatever. <laughs> Political correctness gone mad in it. Uh, you can see her fan art. I've put it as my um as my uh, user um, picture, whatever it is, and um I'll put a link to the whole picture down there. Uh, just keep sending in the fan art, guys. I do appreciate it. I do. Uh, it, it keeps me going. It is. It's what keeps me going. Um. Yeah, fantastic to be honest. Oh, so, oh, oh, I didn't expect such great YouTube success in just a, what, a few days, really. I started, what, Friday, no, Sunday, and I'm already getting fan art. Brilliant. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, that's all I've got time for today, folks. So, um, well, see ya, see ya whenever. Um, uh, just keep watching and keep living.